Good day, Curtis. I apologise for the lighting of this video. It's a bit shoddy because it's going going darkish outside, so I don't want to risk it. Um, and the reason I shall explain now. So basically, someone is on night shift in this household, which means that I don't want to interrupt them whilst they are sleeping because that's rude. So I have sacrificed the lighting quality and also a video on my main channel um, for the sake of someone else. I'm so giving, aren't I? So that means I haven't really recorded in a lot of stuff and it is currently um, half past six when I'm recording this now, so good times. So yesterday you asked me about what I thought of the eclipse yesterday because that was a thing, wasn't it? It didn't really happen though, did it? Not here at least. I mean, we had sort of one, I think it was like 80% or whatever, but it wasn't, wasn't a total one. Wasn't a total one. So as extraordinary as an a eclipse is for an event, I wasn't too thrilled about the whole um, amount of attention it got. On the news it was fine, it was really nice, but my feeds, my Twitter feeds though, they were clogged. And all that for something which wasn't exactly spectacular apart from on the news, it seemed a bit, I don't know, a bit of an overreaction. I don't know if you share this opinion, or maybe it's me just being miserable at it, but I don't know, I don't know. But whilst we're on the topic of natural events, I think there are a lot of um, natural events which go off in the world um, on a yearly basis which is pretty which are pretty damn awesome for example you have the lunar eclipses which happen every so often as well as the solar eclipses which happen every so often you also have the northern lights and various other different natural events which are damn pretty my question to you and the people is going to be really simple if you could see one of the events with your own eye ballings which one would you go and see if you could experience one of these natural events which one would you want to experience? And finally, why? What, what, what would be your reason behind that? For me, it'd probably be the very stereotypical Northern Lights because they are green and awesome, um, but that's just me. So give it some thought, and I'll be interested to hear your opinions. Um, you've got like two days to think about it, so surprise me. I will see you on Monday.